hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here please make sure that you like comment and subscribe i like to throw on cooking videos on my channel your girl loves to eat so if you guys are interested in seeing any of my cooking videos please make sure you check out that playlist tonight i'm going to be making my own twist of the sweet green kale chicken caesar salad i absolutely love this salad and if you know me i'm always thinking about how to save money and how to get more bang for my buck so i decided to make my salad tonight at home with you all so if you guys are interested in it, if you love sweet green and it is the summertime, you want some light, healthy, fit food, then just keep on watching. All right, my first couple of ingredients I purchased at Giant and it is the kale. I like to throw in a little arugula and mines as well. And then I also picked up some white quinoa. I love this because you can actually put this right in the microwave and it's done within like less than five minutes. I love fresh lemon in my salad. It just gives the salad the extra mm and whatever that means but you guys know what that means i love these cheese crisps they're not croutons but they kind of remind me of the texture of a crouton but they're actually just cheese crisps and i love these so i also picked those up at giant i like to use cherry tomatoes i also add in some caesar dressing and the last two items i actually picked up from whole foods i get my chicken breast from whole foods i just feel like it's a lot more fresh you can actually throw in whatever topping if you don't like to eat chicken of course you can throw in shrimp or salmon i try all those things i do not just use chicken breast for this salad so just be creative whatever it is that you gravitate to and last i like to boil an egg to just top my salad off all right, so I like to season my chicken breast with a little Larry season salt. We all have this in our cabinet. Some um, black pepper. I also use these two, the Montreal chicken seasoning, and I love the Weber's roasted garlic and herb seasoning. So these are just my go-to seasonings to season in my chicken breast. I also want to mention that I throw it on the George Furman grill. It takes like less than five minutes. This is a very quick meal. So I'm just going to pop this open. I'm going to slice up quite a few pieces because I want to have some leftovers tomorrow but this is for tonight and i also have my lemon squeezer i'll be using this throughout some point of the video when i skirt my lemon to just finish off my salad but i just wanted to throw that in there because you know i feel a little, a little fancy so i'm just going to slice my chicken breast up into chicken finger like slices and then i'm going to throw some season on it around this point in time i usually like to throw my eggs on because that takes the longest out of everything when i put my chicken breast on the george from the grill it takes literally less than five minutes like i mentioned so i'm just going to season this up All right, now I'm gonna lay my grilled chicken breast on this George Foreman grill. It's gonna take like five minutes to cook. It cooks perfect on the George Foreman grill. It comes out so nice and tender. So I'm gonna put this on here. Then I'm gonna throw my quinoa in the microwave and I'm gonna check on my eggs because it's almost five minutes. All right, so I'm getting ready to throw my quinoa in the microwave. The instructions are on the back. You just heat it up for 90 seconds. You just tear it just like an inch. And then you toss it in the microwave. Easy. All right, I just took all the stems off my kale. Now I'm going to throw some arugula on top. I'm going to mix everything together, of course, but I like to add some arugula. I'm just going to throw in a handful of that. I'm going to chop up my cherry tomatoes, cut my lemon. I'm going to add all of this to the top of my salad before I mix it through. All right, so I threw my cherry tomatoes on top, my arugula's on top. Now I'm going to go ahead and squeeze some fresh lemon juice on top. And I like to add my lemon juice before I add my cheese crisp because it'll make the cheese crisp just a little bit soggy. And then I'm going to toss in some kiwi. 
Next, I'm gonna add in my Caesar dressing. All right, so I just finished mixing every, all the dressing through the salad really good, and now I'm gonna begin to plate my food. all right guys that concludes this video for tonight i enjoyed making my sweet green salad with you all i hope you guys enjoyed this short recipe to just have at home it's light it's fit why not it's perfect for the summertime this is actually perfect all year round so i cannot wait to dive into this salad thanks for tuning in with me make sure you give this video a thumbs up and i will see you guys next time bye This is so good.